With the schedule being completely thrown for a loop due to the travel to Chicago, here you're gonna see just the combination of Wednesday and Thursday for the video. Good morning on this fabulous Wednesday, starting out the episode with our shout outs to the new subscribers, Alyssa Alante, what's up? Thank you for the subscription. And Lana Elzine, or Elzine, Elzine? Lana, El Lana Elzine. Stein, Elzine. Thank you both so much for the subscription. I really appreciate it. That puts me at 98. I cannot believe I'm at two away from 100. That's just crazy. If you guys have any suggestions for what I think you should do when we hit 100 subscribers, leave a comment below. What do you want to see? Midterm for Jill. We've got animal etudes plus our Pilates quiz. I'm going to show you guys the animal etudes, but we got to get to class. We've been going in the Pilates room one at a time for our Pilates portion of the midterm. Antony is in there right now. I'll be the last one to go. Everybody else is upstairs, but you go in. Jill gives you one of the series that we've learned, and you go through each exercise, demonstrating proper technique, proper breathing, and any notes that she's given us about those uh, those moves before you go in there. So I'm up next. Magically, just like that, it's Thursday. Because of the whole travel to Chicago and everything, we're just gonna go to mix this episode up. No. Guys, this is Emmanuel. He's one of the first year MFAs. Yo, yo. Totally awesome, dude. He's in the Wilson Williams Festival. Where are you guys performing? Uh, we're gonna be here in the Hillbury Rehearsal Room. Boom, right there in the Hillbury Rehearsal Room. Uh, I gotta get in there for streetcar, but good to see you, man. Good to see you Take too, buddy. <laughs> Come on, the scream yeah, He knows it, he knows it. So I went to Chicago for one night, one night, and I come home, and I don't hate it. To be perfectly clear, I actually really like it, but in that one night, Kira got a little pumpkin sweater for Alistair. Where'd you go? There he is. He's got a little pumpkin Halloween t-shirt. Look at him. Look how cute he is. He's so cute. So now Alistair's very seasonal and ready for Halloween. Not okay, about it comes. It may be it's too big for it's him. It's a little too big for him. But he doesn't hate it. He he doesn't hate it actually. It's kinda I've been surprised. Well, yeah. Yeah. Alistair, tell the people. Tell the people how you feel. Alistair. Yeah. Yeah. Is mom gonna is mom gonna have a great show tonight at Evil Dead? Alistair. <laughs> Just lays on the stairs. 
Performance of Evil Dead tonight. Full run through of Streetcar Named Desire. We are down to 15 days till opening, November 3rd. Be there. I'm at 15 days. It's gonna too. be good. <laughs> See that man? Santino Craven? He's living the dream. Tonight we're running Streetcar. We had an afternoon rehearsal, cleaning up a few things, but we are down to six days until we are in the Hillbury Theater where we'll be re-spacing, blocking, and making sure everything looks good, and then continuing into Tech Weekend. We are 10 out of 12 Tech next Saturday, so moving right along in terms of getting this ready. Oh yeah, what's up party people? It is Thursday, oddly enough. You heard it from my mouth first. Heck Robbie. First place winner, Cody Robinson. Very proud of my man. He's gonna make some edits. They're going to produce, and that play is going to be going up in the spring. So if you wanna see it, you should come check it out. I'm gonna drop my stuff up. We're gonna get ready. We are doing the run. And then I'm gonna be exhausted from that. And then I'm gonna go home and have homework to do. Living the dream. Hashtag.